Congressman Ron DeSantis' trip to Israel is being criticized on social media as a junket. But the Florida leader is pushing back, saying the round trip to Tel Aviv is already benefiting the Sunshine State. Here's our Capitol Bureau correspondent, Mike Vasilinda, who also went for the, the ride. Governor Ron DeSantis is back at work here in the States after four full days in Israel. He's calling his trade mission a success, but only time will tell how successful. Dozens of agreements were signed between Israeli institutions and Florida universities. Uh, I think what you're doing here is building an infrastructure that's going to pay results for many, many years to come. Someone invariably is going to call it a junket. What would you say to them? Well, you've been following me around. Has it been much of a junket? I mean, we've been working hard, but it's been very productive. And um, I think, um, you know, the relationship is going to going to continue to to, uh, to foster. The vast majority of the people on the trip paid their own way, but there were 20 state employees and four statewide elected officials. Their cost probably in the $7,000 range as an average, and then their security, which remains classified. Reporting from the state capitol, Mike Vasilinda, News Channel 8.